Our In Good Company segment is a little bit different this week. SmartTab is a startup pharmaceutical company in Denver working on a way to deliver much needed medication through a high tech capsule. But last week, SmartTab founder Robert Nischel died unexpectedly. His family has vowed to carry on the company and innovation in his honor. So our story includes Denver 7's interview with Robert before his passing. Robert Nischel was on a path to a major advancement in the pharmaceutical world, combining modern technology with an everyday drug capsule. We want to make this capsule look like any other capsule. So when you take it like a you know, vitamin or maybe a Lipitor, um, it's the same size, it looks the same, you take it with a glass of water. But the capsule does so much more. It includes tiny electronics, a battery, timer, and microchip to communicate with an external device like a smartwatch or tablet and self-deliver medicines that would otherwise need a syringe. So the end user will be a patient that has a chronic disease that perhaps they have to take an injection once a day or once a week, self-inject for many years. SmartTab was a finalist at this year's South by Southwest pitch event where Lance Armstrong was one of the judges. The capsule could be used for vaccines. It could relay vital biological functions to your doctor. Your doctor could even change the dose or program a timed release of the drug. Here's how it works. But you basically swallow a capsule on an empty stomach. It migrates to the bottom of the stomach. Um, it will self-orientate in a vertical position. It has built-in sensors that once those sensors give it a green light, it will make a very fast injection. It then flushes out naturally through your system. But Nischel says the pain and anxiety of needles is a big inhibitor to patients getting the right meds when they need it. SmartTab takes that fear out of the equation. You know, they don't have to get up in the morning and say, wow, today's a day I have to stab myself in the leg and, you know, all the anxiety going through that and then the pain and the recovery and the leg swells up. And so all that goes away. Pretty incredible. Robert was working closely with the FDA to gain approval. SmartTab will go through animal trials this summer with the hope of moving on to human trials next year and then launching in 2024. It is SmartTab.co if you would like to learn more. Robert was 59 years old and is survived by his wife and two children.